Welcome, ladies and gentlemen. It's truly a privilege to be able to share our experience on this uh, very challenging treatment group of patients. Traumatic dental injury and ankylosed teeth in relation to dental implant dentistry is the topic. And the outline of my presentation will be, I'll start by addressing the epidemiology and etiology, the treatment planning of these treatment, uh, this patient group, the different clinical indications, temporary final, and sum up with some uh, conclusions and clinical recommendations. Traumatic dental injuries are quite prevalent. 30% in the primary dentition and 22% in the permanent dentition. And most of these accidents having, ha happens during childhood or early adolescence. And as you may, may expect, also with boys being more frequently hit than girls. Important to remember is that the majority of traumatic dental injuries actually have an excellent prognosis. And if you don't know this website, I would like to draw your attention to the uh, Dental Trauma Guide. You, these illustrations are from the Dental Trauma Guide, and you see the wide, large variation of character and severity of dental trauma. In the Dental Trauma Guide, you can just by clicking the characteristics of the actual trauma, the patient, the conditions around the trauma, the root stage, development, you will have the treatment, uh, the preferred treatment served for you, and you will also have the prognosis, if in doubt at all. 